broke maths. You mean Matt Parker broke maths? Stand up maths broke <laughs> maths. <laughs> okay. Uh, in You're this watching this video. video. There is only one true parabola. I didn't find any com uh, comments saying that. Yeah, but. You think you think Matt broke math here? So uh, and I saw Simon really upset why? today, and I was like, "Why are you almost crying?" And he said, "But this whole calculation that math has shown it, it it's gonna break math." All right. So and I said, let, let, "Let's make a video about that." Matt, Matt is shown in this video, and all the steps are okay. I. Uh, no cheating here, or was there? I. I don't think Matt ever cheats. I'm sure here are two parabolas, and the two parabolas. What you showed is that the two are similar, but at the same time, he proved that they're not. Okay. He proved that this parabola, or actually also, you could use the same argument switched around, so also this parabola, is not equal to itself. So, uh, if this is a parabola, y equals a x squared, and this is a parabola y equals b x squared, y x, uh, then the shape y equals b x squared is not equal to itself y equals b x squared. We're going to use the same argument switch around, so we get y equals a x squared is not equal to y equals a x squared. What? We've reached an impossible contradiction. But Matt didn't think it was impossible. No, we it we've we've reached an impossible contra contradiction. This if it's something is always equal to itself, right? That's law in mathematics. So so. But wasn't that proved by contradiction or something? So so. so so, both of these parabolas don't exist, but they obviously do, right? It's not like, these, so he showed that these parabolas aren't shapes, but of course they are, right? So, but he was trying to prove Again, what? That, we've, we're reaching an impossible contradiction again? So, so Simon? This may break math not once and not twice, but... Actually, three th uh, or maybe just twice, but. But wasn't it trying to prove that there exists only one true parabola? Yes. So, so maybe it was actually like focused on that and, and made them like realize that we broke maths in that video. Broke maths. But he, he doesn't have this line in his video, does he? No. You worked it out from where? From this line he has, or not? No, uh, because he proved that where did you these get parabolas this? aren't similar, but he's shown that these parabolas are similar, so... But similar is not the same as equals. 
Similar is not the same as equal, yeah. Yeah, but if something is not even similar, that means it's not equal. Yeah, that's true. So, 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 so this is still true. But I still don't understand where you got this line from. Where I got this line from? Because... Because if both isn't similar and is similar, which means it has to be two different shapes at once, if you think about it. Which is also possible. So maybe this is not quite true. Maybe I have to say, like, y equals bx squared is two shapes at once. This thing's two, or both of these are two shapes at once. But of course they're only one shape. So maybe my logic earlier wasn't quite right. But if it wasn't, so, uh, but if it wasn't, these shapes are two shapes at once. But of course they are, right? This shape is this shape. This shape is this shape, right? B times x2 squared. That means that x2, y2 are on the second y equals b x squared parabola. We can map any parabola onto any other parabola by scaling it evenly in every direction by a scale factor of a on b. All parabolas are similar. There is only no true parabola. Hang on. So, because, because if you watch Matt's video, you can use the same argument switched around to find that the other parabola is, is also not a parabola. Well, even more than that, it's not a shape, but So there is even no true parabola, which also kind of contradicts, because by definition there is a parabola, right? So so right? So it contradicts not once, not twice, but. Three times, in fact, it might even contradict four times. No, three, actually. So, even though Matt proves in his video, that these two parabolas are similar, he proves at the beginning that they aren't. Because even, because you these two rectangles are definitely not similar, according to the definition. You, you can translate, rotate, scale evenly, or flipping, and 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 match one rectangle exactly onto the other one, that's not true. So these rectangles aren't similar. Even if you said, like, that side length equal to that side length, or that side length equal to that side length, or whatever, um, you cannot make them similar. Okay. So. I see that point. 
So basically you're saying that the proof Matt is giving in this video is, is not a good one because it breaks math. Yeah. And this means that the whole idea that Matt has about there is only one parabola, uh, but, uh, it's not true. Yeah, you could use the same argument switched around to see that the other parabola is not a parabola. So whatever two parabolas you pick, they're not gonna they're not gonna be parabolas. In fact, they're not gonna be shaped, they're not even gonna exist. Uh which means that there is no true parabola. All parabolas are different. Well, how would you formulate it then? There is no true parabola because you could extend his argument, just switch it around. Like he proves that this parabola right there, that that yellow one there, is is not a parabola. You can use the same argument switched around to prove that this parabola is also not a parabola. Yeah. All right. And whatever you to you pick, they're not going to be ver so there is no true parabola, which is also kind of contra contradicting itself because by definition there's there's a there by definition there is there is a parabola, right? So if there is only one, it wouldn't be sensible to say that there are. But you're saying it. Both of these parabolas are two shapes at once. Not both of them together, but this parabola is two shapes at once. This parabola is two shapes, at, two different shapes at once, which is obvi also obviously not true. In the final, and finally, the third contradictory answer, self-contradictory self result. We've we've got this parabola. Parabola, they both, they not only they are parabolas, they are chicks. They don't even exist. So, and obviously that's also not that true, right? So, I mean, how do we com come out of this conundrum? What is the correct statement? What is the correct statement? That there exist well, many different I, parabolas? I Video. Maybe so we'll make like a response video to a response video. <laughs> <Make> <laughs> All it, right. And so yeah. 